Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Persona 3 Fez. In the last one, we did a long Tartar session. And you'll probably notice that everybody's still here. Well, that's because I'm just, I'm just, I'm just tired. I'm just tired, yeah. Um, I, <laughs> my main character is literally tired. But all the rest of my characters, they're all, I don't know. I've used them enough. I've done enough grinding. If I have to come back in here and grind some more, I will. I'll just try not to oversave my save. Um, but anyways, in the meantime... Uh, I did some quests, guys. I did some quests. So let's go ahead and turn those bitches in. I finally, 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 finally got that goddamn Tsuno Mitsuno or whatever the fuck it's called. So let's freaking turn that bitch in. Otenta Mitsuno or whatever. This katana. It's the famous sword that repels darkness. The Otenta Mitsuyo. There are several legends surrounding the Otenta, but a couple of them are especially interesting. The Maeda family's daughter grew ill, and no one knew what caused it. So her father borrowed the Utenta from Hitotoshi to Toyotomi and left it by her pillow. Her sickness was cured. But once her he returned the Utenta, her sickness returned, so he went back to borrow the Utenta again. This happened time and time again, until Hideyoshi told him to keep the Utenta. The Maeda family have, may have faked their daughter's sickness to obtain the Utenta. But now that I see the katana, it's so beautiful that if this was their plan, I can't blame them. Well then... <laughs> Can't hate on that. Wand of King times three, baby. All right. Um, speaking of quests, though, I did some other stuff off screen that should let us finish off some quests. So, second thing we want to do, I finally performed Thunder Call. How did I do that? I got the persona called Thor, the God of Thunder. And pretty much once I got that and I picked up a Taka Mikazuchi, boom, Thunder Call, easy peasy. Basically, it's a really strong thunder magic spell, that, and it hits all enemies. It's pretty good. I, I would likely use it again if I need to use some thunder on an enemy, like, on purpose. Um, let's see, I didn't get any gold medals yet. I did create Giram, Giram, Giramakala, Giram, Giramakala. Uh, I created this one. It was actually pretty easy. All you had to do was, uh, it was one of the cross four Persona fusions, right? Yeah, I think, I think that's right. I think it was the bottom one. It was the one that was, like, a like the the hermit one i think I, I don't even remember anyway i did that one and i think that's all actually that we have right yeah that's it let's turn him in i see that Giram Kala now resides within you well done you have fulfilled my request i have prepared a special reward for you once again with it you will be able now be able to create nebiros if you are strong enough to control this persona then please give it a try sick all right got a marionette to be able to create nebiros and we also have the thunder call one done I have confirmed your casting of the fusion spell, Thundercall. A contest of strength between the two Thunder Gods. My hair would stand up so much that it would feel like it was trying to escape my head. Okay. Cool. I guess. Do you have new quests now? She probably does. Thundercall is one that's been there for a long time. Perform King and I, Black Frost, and a Kingly Persona. Well, I have Black Frost. I'm not entirely sure I know what the Kingly Persona is. Huh. S outfit main. I guess that means outfit for my main character. I gotta figure out what the kingly persona is for that. Maybe I'll do that one right now if I figure it out. Because I have Black Frost. I'd like to finish all the quests now if I could. Wait, what's this one? Create Daisu Ju. Okay, let me look into these two real quick and I'll be RB. I want to do these now if I can. I got the money. And if I can just fuse some personas real quick and I have what I need, then I'll do them real quick. So hold up one tech. Okay, we're here, and we can now fuse Dai Soj Hole. So let's go ahead and do it real quick, because that seems like an easy one. I don't really care what abilities it has, do I? It's only level 53, so it's not really super high level. Do I care? I don't know. It's not a lot of good abilities. I mean, it has its own good abilities, and it's about to go up 10 anyways. But the personas we're fusing to get it are all kind of shitty, so... Not a lot of good of abilities to actually hand out for this motherfucker, so... Whatever, dude. We got Daisojo, or whatever, however you pronounce it. Daisojo! You would be mine. Oh, no, I do not want anything to happen to hide Hama own. Thank you. Like your best move. Why the fuck would I want something to happen to it? Unless Samsara is good. I don't even know what the hell Samsara does. Something's about to have my own. No! Stop trying to kill Hama own! Stop it! Mold Dark would be nice. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm probably gonna go ahead and just get rid of Paz Moody, because it's stupid. Stupid move. Okay, so we got Dai Sojo. That's cool. Um, I also figured out what I need 
to do the, uh, uh, the, uh, the, 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 the ability. It's easy. It's just Black Frost and King Frost. Easy peasy, right? Um, yeah. So let's, uh, do that real quick, and I'll be right back. Wait, do I actually have to leave? Or I just have to, do I just have to have the ability? That's one question I have. Like, if I put, if I put the Personas on, and then I, uh, Black Frost, King Frost. Pretty sure that's right. If I put the personas on, and then I go and and just do I have to fight a battle? Cause I can fight a battle real quick, I and mean, that's not a big deal. If I have to fight a battle, let's see. Let's just see what happens when I put them. If I put on King Frost or Black Frost, I don't know. All right, well, whatever. I'll BRB. Um, Maybe I'll show the ability when I use it. BRB. With King Frost and Black Frost, you can use King and I. All right, let's see what King and I does. Deals medium ice damage. It's not gonna do shit to this golden hand. Hey, whatever, let's see. And... Booyah, we did it. Oh shit, Never mind. it's gonna kill it in one hit. I hated on it for no reason at all. Nice, I got a Nihil Longsword. Actually, that's pretty sick, because I don't think I've gotten one of those before. All right, cool, that was good. All right, um, BRB. Actually, I don't need to BRB. We'll just do this. We'll just use a Tristo gem, because I don't think I'm going to need one. I don't think I'm going to need one anytime soon. And I know how we could get some more of them, so just use one. So now that we have the persona we need and we did the ability I wanted to do, let's go do these quests real quick. I know this episode, I don't really have any plans for this episode in terms of what I wanted to get done, but I figured since there's some quests left to do, and I know how to, and I, that we could probably pull them off with the amount of money I have laying around. Let's just do them now. Um, what am I doing? That's not the right thing. Quests. So let's go ahead and grab King and I. I didn't want to grab them until I knew I was going to be able to do them. Anyway, those are both done now. So let's go ahead and turn them in. I see that Daisojo now resides within you. It is a hard persona to come by, even through fusion. Yet you added it to your repertoire so easily. It seems you are quickly mastering the art of fusion. It's pretty easy when you tell me the five I need, and I have all five, and then I just do it, and I'm the right level, of course. That matters. Space badge. Huh, I wonder what that does. Anyway, you, I've confirmed your casting of the fusion spell, King and I. The blizzard they summon can freeze every cell in their bodies. I think I know what causes this. In our bodies. Perhaps Black Frost has fallen out of favor with the king, and it's venting his anger. Perhaps... Perhaps. Anyway, I got that main outfit. I don't even know what that means. All right, more quests. Perform best friends. You will need Fornius and a star-shaped persona. Ooh, I bet you I have that because I have a star-shaped persona. Ooh, I kind of want to do these if they're going to give me alternate outfits, dude. Hell yeah. I'm going to do... Wait, create Alice with Megado? Oh my god, with Megado? Lame. I have an Alice, but I definitely don't think she has Megado. But that's good to know. Um, I'll have to figure out a way I can get to that point. I don't know if I'm going to do that right now, but I'm definitely going to do this one right now. Hell yeah. Um, let me double check if I have Fornius for sure. Let me double check if I know if I have the right uh, for, uh, per star persona. I'm not entirely sure I know I have it. Um, I need to make space anyway, so I'll BRB. With De Dekarabi and Fornius' power, you're able to use best friends! Alright guys, you ready for some super best friends time? Combines all Kaja skills on an ally. What the hell? Let's try it out. Super best friends, go! So Dekarabia is actually one that I've seen in my fusion list as I was, you know, when I'm trying to fuse stuff. But I never had fused it before, I realized. So anyway, I had to fuse one. He was easy enough to fuse, though. Just required a bunch of fool arcana guys to fuse him, because he's fool arcana as well. Easy peasy. Alright, so we just did best friends, and guess what? There's a freaking teleporter right here. So perfect! Turn to the entrance. Alright, that's another quest in the bag. I'm pretty sure I grabbed the quest while I was there. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Shit, this episode might just be, be me knocking out all these freaking uh, fusion spell quests just because I'm getting cool outfits. Or at least, I don't know if they're cool outfits yet, but I'm getting outfits. Oh, sorry. They say that Dekarabia waited for its friend Fornius without knowing that he had died. Every day without fail, just waiting. That is the meaning of best friends. Don't forget to carry a handkerchief when you use it. Okay, because it might bring a tear to my eye is what you're saying? Anyway, we got an outfit for Yukari. Hell yeah. Anything else? 
Oh yeah, they're gonna make me do all the freaking fusion abilities, aren't they? Anyway, Summer Dream, you'll need Oberon and his wife. Who the fuck's Oberon's wife? Freaking, freaking uh, Oberon, his wife. He didn't have a wife. I've seen Game of Thrones. Wow. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and just grab that. Anything else new that's popped up other than Alice with Megado? Not really. All right. Anything I should register? Um, Decorabia? Oh yeah, we should probably register him. I just fused him. Um, uh, yeah, I guess let me look into this one and I'll be RB. There are two enemies. Okay, if I put on Titania, with Titania and Oberon's power, you're able to use Summer Dream. Sick. So, Titania, we uh, have documented that persona very well. What does it do? Unpredictable effect. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Anyway, and Oberon is an old persona we've had for a long time. Let's see what it does. Summer Dream. Fancy. Everyone knocked down. Well, that sucks. As long as it's not everyone gets murdered, I'm okay with it. That was kind of weird, though. Everyone knocked down. Okay, so what is the purpose of everyone being knocked down? That seems like it serves zero purpose. Just knocks everyone on their ass. Well, I mean, it says you, you don't know what the effect will be, which means it's not going to always do that, probably. It's probably random. Oh, great. I'm too tired to stand up. Even on the first floor, we're fighting the weakest enemies in the game. Well, it's a good thing I got Ken Kun with his 1 fucking thousand damage on a regular attack. I'm scared what Junpei is about to do. Oh, God, he's getting crit hit, too. 2,000! Yeah, that's right. Suck it, first floor enemies. Suck it. What the f- I don't want this shit. Get the experience boost. Get the experience boost, guys. Yes! Yes! That 1 XP. Did you see that? I boosted 1 XP to become 1 XP. It was sick, right? Anyway, cool. That was an easy one. I'm probably- I literally am probably gonna sit here and do all these if I can. I'm not even joking. I will do all of these right now. Like, this seems more productive than going back and whatever the fuck else I can do right now. And fail at doing social links, basically. I have confirmed your casting of the fusion spell Summer Dream. The mysterious effect might be related to the tempestuous love from the fairy court. I've heard that love is also quite mysterious in the human world. Okay, that was a strange explanation. Anyway, we've got Junpei's alternate outfit. Sick. Sick. Um, okay. Let's, uh, see if you got another one of those. You got another one? Of course you do. It's called Dream Fest. I've been dreaming, dreaming about my dream fest. Okay, so we need Incubus and his female counterpart. Well, okay. I'll, uh, BRB with that, I guess. If I can. Alright, you little bitch. With Incubus and Succubus' power, you are able to use Dream Fest. Okay, so one thing I want to note about Incubus real quick. I didn't have him, first of all. But look at him. He's got a giant, spiky cock. Do I need to say anything else? I don't think so. I don't think so. It freaked me out a little bit when I first saw it. I was like, what the fuck? Anyway, it looks like it charms all foes with high odds. That's not bad. I mean, I'd be charmed with her half-naked ass and that giant spiky dick, too. Seriously. Uh, how can one resist the giant fucking claw dick that will probably stab right through you and murder you? I mean, who could resist? Am I right? Anyway, that's a thing. That's now done, so yay. I'm literally going to sit here and do all these. If, th if there is one for every freaking fusion skill in the game, I will do them all. I didn't know there was going to be a quest for all of them. I thought it was just going to be like, here's that fusion skills exist. Figure them all out if you want to kick ass. I have confirmed your casting of the fusion spell Dreamfest, a dance that charms all who see it. I wonder how that dance is performed. I would love to join in. <laughs> uh, I showed you how to do that dance already. Don't you remember? I mean, I don't have a huge, giant, spiky cock. That's a fucking giant demon claw. But it was close enough, am I right? No? Maybe? I don't know. Scarlet Havoc. Ares and a Teutonic Dragon Slayer. Well, I'm pretty sure I have Ares, but what the fuck's the Teutonic Dragon Slayer? Guess we'll be right back. With Ares and Siegfried's power, you were able to use Scarlet Havoc. Awesome. Siegfried is actually one I already had in my inventory. That was pretty sick. He's pretty high level one, so I'm kind of glad I already had him. Um, so let's see what Scarlet Havoc does. It deals heavy slash damage to all foes. Well, then watch all these bitches fall before me. Because Ares, who actually is a pretty low level persona, combined with a high level persona, 
Holy crap, that's an awesome skill. I would probably never have Ares on me though, he's so low level. Hey look! Kenkun's actually tired. I was wondering if my characters would actually get tired while I'm doing this. This is actually really worth it, just for the sake of the fact that we're finishing quests, and if I get all my characters tired in the pro process, then even better, because that makes this trip, the, you know, that finishes off the Tartar trip complete. Makes it, makes this whole trip feel like it was worth it. Because we used up all of our tiredness. Anyway, Ken Coon's gonna go home right now, so we'll just pick up somebody else in his stead. Yeah, go home, kid. You look tired, kid. Go home. All right. You know what? We'll pick up Akihiko. Add him in there. I don't know. I just I picked him. We're gonna go the all man squad. Girls, no girls allowed. Boys rule, girls drool. Duh, duh, duh. I have confirmed your casting of the fusion spell, Scarlet Havoc. In this fusion spell, you slice the enemy into a million tiny slivers. If one were to be sliced that many times, there would be nothing left but a pile of dust. Oh, is the dust at your feet? Uh, yeah, it's it's there. Just look harder. So who doesn't have an outfit yet? Uh, are we going to get an outfit for Ken? Are we going to get an outfit for the dog? For I guess? All three? Apparently we're going to get... Oh, whoa, whoa. W outfit for Maine. What? I don't know what that means, but I'm going to get it, whatever it is. Um, fusion skill Valhalla. Valkyrie as well as her master. Okay, let me look into this one. I'll be RB. All right. With Odin and Valkyrie's power, you were able to use Valhalla. Okay, so first thing before I use Valhalla, which is Odin and Valkyrie, invulnerability for one turn for one ally, but I don't like the sound of that. Um, you'll notice that Akihiko, Junpei, and main character are all wearing different outfits. Now, I realize what S outfit means. It means summer outfits. So the outfits that everybody wears in the summer, that's the outfit they're wearing for S outfit. So, that's cool. Um, I don't really remember what the girls' outfits were off the top of my head. I'm sure if I see them, I'll go, oh yeah. But uh, the point is, that's not as cool as I thought. I thought it was going to be something unique and new, but whatever. It's cool. I'm not saying it's not cool. I shouldn't say it's not cool. But it's not as cool as I thought it was going to be. I thought we were going to get something more unique. But that's cool. Whatever. It is what it is. We move on. We get over it. We, uh, we, uh, we carry on. Anyway, we did our new ability, which seemed okay, I guess. I don't know what butt meant, but I guess we'll never know what butt meant. But now I know what W outfit means. Now that I've deciphered what S outfit means, I'm assuming W outfit means that it's the winter outfits for everyone. So we're probably going to get all of the damn fusion skills asked of us about right now if I really want to do them all. Anyway, I've confirmed your casting of the fusion spell, Valhalla. Those who are called to Odin's Hall by the Valkyries, they become immortal warriors fighting into eternity. Immortality may sound nice, but please be careful. Okay, I'll be super careful. Anyway, now we got the winner outfit for the main character. Let me guess, there's another one, and the uh, and it's for gonna be Yukari's. Yep, winner outfit Yukari. Kuchu Lane, I'm pretty sure I've made that one. And his instructor, oh god, here we go again. Here we go again. Okay, I'm back. I I just realized, or I didn't know really, is that to do this one, I, I have Kuchu Lane, but his instructor is actually a persona that I will never be able to get, and thus our our ability to do all the quests and get all these outfits is now thwarted, and I have to drop this quest. You know why? Because to get that persona that I need, I forget what his name is off the top of my head now, it's a weird name. Sackman, we'll call him, I don't really remember. Uh, to do that quest, I actually need to fuse a priestess persona that requires Fuka to be maxed out social link. Son of a bitch. That's actually upsetting. Which makes me think we'll run into another one of those if we try to do all these quests. So, I'm just going to give up here. That's where we stop. Sad story, I know. I know. Freaking sad. Actually, oh shit. I forgot to grab a lover's persona while I was there whatever dude this episode's about to end i know this is going to be end up being a shorter episode because i have it all cut up i've all i've almost been recording for an hour already and this is probably going to end up being like a 30 20 20 30 minute episode maybe even not even i don't even know it's going to be weird to have such a short episode but honestly i'm i i i was on such a roll and i was all excited to come across that being a thing it's just like oh thanks game thanks should I just grab Raphael? Raphael's a pretty good persona to have, and it has high-ass freaking luck. I'm going to go ahead and just grab grab this one. I know it's expensive, 
I usually grab the cheapest one, but Raphael I'll actually use, so we'll just grab him. Um, yeah, got my lovers one. I got my empress one. We should be good to do social links. I'm I'm a little I'm a little I'm a little sad. I'm a little sad about it. Um, yeah, yeah. But in the next episode, we'll continue on with the story and get to the next full moon and see what happens. Uh, or actually, we're just going to get to New Year's and make a choice. I don't know if making a choice is going to require any fighting, but we'll make that choice and we'll see what happens. Hopefully my characters are leveled enough. Like I said, I'll, I'll, have a, I'll keep my save handy if I need to come back in this. Uh, in fact, I haven't left Tartarus yet, so we'll save it here. I'll, I'll save it right here at this point. And if I need to come back here and do a little bit more grinding, I will. Um, obviously, Ken is ruled out, but that's fine. Fuck Ken. I'm not going to use him. Anyways, next time. Peace.